Oh, he flashed him. He flashed on me. Please kill him. Oh, God, we can't kill this guy. I put this ward here in case Keen wants to invade my rates. It's actually very common. Looks like he didn't, so we're good. So he's starting either his rates or his red or, or his wolves. You can kind of start either of those. If goes to my blue, I run at him with that little ward that Zed put down. Should be able to see him. I'd be surprised if that doesn't catch him. Okay, let's do it. Reverse daddy double lift on the enemy Jinx, so we gotta we gotta lock in. Cause you know if we lose, he's gonna be Timo Jungle, Timo Jungle. So we gotta really make him eat his words here. We took down Shifter the other day. We took down T1 the other day. Now it's double lift's turn. So the Timo Jungle Madness. We've actually been on quite a little winning spree too, so. Janna's warding blue, I like that. I'm not gonna take the invade, or should I take the invade? Okay, I'll rock with Janna here. Kane's pretty weak early, and we have Pryos, so. Okay, Shanna's 1v9 completely. We have the Kane here. Now we keep going. The Shanna's 1v9 off her sack. That's okay. I just want to get the camp. We got to be careful of the Sona pinching us. Okay, so we get this camp. He's going to go to my blue. Arjana is an angel. I want to keep fighting. I'm going to go here. I'm going to go meet him at my blue. Because he's going to go right to my blue. I'll meet him over there. I don't want Seth to do it alone. I, I want to meet him. He's going to be somewhere over here. There's no way he's not. Did he actually check the Gromp or no? Janna just made an all-star play. Bonk? Yo! Holy bonk. Holy cahoots. Should I stir up a little drama and say I'm ghosting? To be fair, like, that was insane. Yeah, he was. That's insane. The Jana made an insane play mid lane, and the set just tracked that cane. We also did a good job being there. Without me, he wouldn't have died, right? So me basing instead of taking his blue worked out for the best. Because we knew he was going to do that. But that bonk was absolutely gnarly. Okay, so what do we do here? We know Kane, Kane has a choice. He can go to his Krugs or his Raids. Doesn't have to go to one or the other. I could base for my boots. I have the gold for it. I think that would be pretty good. Can I base for boots and a dagger? That would be ideal. 800? Don't have it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look to get a word on his rates. Maybe even an invade. Maybe I should have went to his rates instead of doing my wolves here. So if he's not on this... Okay, so that means he's bottom, right? Because if he's not over here, where is he going to be? He's going to be bottom. Or taking my rates. He's, we, we have him tracked pretty hardcore here. Oh, there he is. That's fine. Massive. So he was just late to his rates. That's fine, though. Proactive jungling. His blue's still up. We want to dive him down. That's okay. We don't want to get too crazy here and give a freebie back or anything. We're playing well. Our team's also playing well. Kudos to them. I think I want to take my base here. Because, like, we could go try and get his blue. I don't think it's worth it. Don't do it, Sona. You fucking rat. Sona's just hanging out, walking around. Denies a kill. If I was Zed, I'd be so salty. Kane's bottom. Kane's for sure bottom. I still need a base. I should have base. I kind of got lost in the sauce. I'm not going to lie. Now I'm not even on point for grubs. Like, what's the point of getting so far ahead if I can't even do grubs? Can't even get the objectives. Nice try. Hmm. 
I mean, we definitely are going to be here for this. We're missing that top wave at potentially getting Kane. Damn, that top wave is fat. I wonder what Tom's up to. He's not wrong, right? Like, my team is helping out a ton. We're also capitalizing pretty well. He's not wrong, but we are, we also are doing our part. I take a base here. I don't want to sack too much tempo. Because, like, I could just go clear my camps, but that's not really playing to win. I want to defend everything and shit. Okay, I'm going to get the scuttle. That's the least I can do. Kane could be... A good invade here would be if Kane takes my red. I really need a base. Like, if he takes my red, he's playing really well. Good from him. I'm not going to go to his red. I really need a. I really need a base. Like, you can't just stay on the map forever. So we could do our red. We get level six, then we look for Drake. There's Kane. Nice. He didn't take my camps. That's good. This is probably the worst play he could do. But he's kind of probably shell shocked from being invaded so much. He's not down in ECS. He's doing a good job getting his farm, right? Like, you can only deny so much on the, the old Teemo jungle, but I like where we're at. I want to start getting objectives. There's no point just permit running at him. We got to get the objectives. We got the grubs. Let's start getting the Drake. We see Kane. That's chill. Uh-oh, Seth's kind of falling behind now. I'm going to get this first before Drake. So they have a Wincon and a Tom Kench. Set had that one roam, but that one roam didn't really affect him. He didn't even miss CS. So it's kind of tough that he's behind, but it is what it is. I'm, I'm on my way. We could still just do Drake. I feel like we should just be doing the Drake here. That's never really going to work out. Darren has prize, so we gotta be a little careful. This is where we start fucking up, because Garen also has Pryo. Yeah, that works out. We get the Drake, and we get the kill. We get Garen too, that'd be sick. He just phase rushes out of there like a Oh, Tom's... Oh, run! Everybody abort! Abort mission! Tom tp That's beautiful. Nice! Tom teleported. That's huge for us. Absolutely beautiful. That's really good that he wasted TP. Now we basically go topside. Run! There's a freaking Tom Kench here. All right, that's beautiful. We we ran at Kane. We didn't just get complacent and do the Drake. We, we zoned Kane off it, and we actually got a kill. And he was in me, so he couldn't get the smite off. That was really good. Really, really good. Okay, great game so far. Again, right? My team, my Janna is really popping off, right? And our set roamed one singular time, but we are min maxing the value of having a good team this game, right? Like, we are just, we're playing pretty flawlessly. So, good team plus good gameplay I'm in a pretty favorable spot. We just have to not get bait into going top because this guy's a freaking raid boss. Without Ignite, I feel like we can't ever kill him. We have to get him under the tower. And freaking be willing on him. We can't get caught by him in the river. I want the scuttle, but I don't want to die for it. Kind of have to have set weather the storm. He got a lot of gold there. He got he got a hell of plates. That's good. But we don't like we don't take a gank up here. I don't think it's gonna be worth it. Okay, I mean he's kind of just. Can we get him into the turret? Maybe. It's gonna be close. I know Kane's nearby. This is either really good or really bad. We'll find out. Okay, we had the sauce. We had the sauce. Beautiful. That was really risky. Either Kane gets there and aces us, or we actually get the kill. So we let Set push out top, because hopefully Kane goes for Set and not for me. So I can kill Kane 1v1, but I don't want him to steal the grubs. Remember, all this doesn't matter if we don't get objectives. You, you have to get jungle objectives. 
That's how you actually win the game. Okay, massive. Okay, he got that smoke. He gets one. That's a little bit of a misplay. He gets one. Could be worse. Probably could have pulled it out. Honestly, I didn't expect him to actually be there. Or be just hanging out in the wall. He just literally did a drive-by smite. Yeah, we go bottom here. We look for this fight. I'm pretty fed. We just want to force. King can go mid, but I still want to go bottom. Do I just run it down the gullet or what? We know Kane's here, but that's fine. Kane's here. It's still fine, right? We don't have to go too crazy. All right, we'll, we'll take the one. Don't want to die to Kane. Oh, you little rat pig. That was the most criminal steal I've ever seen. But it's okay. She's playing great, so we got to give her. She can take what she wants. It's Dami Mommy. Hey, isn't Kane still right here? Yeah, Kane's still right there. Be careful. Diana's playing so well, you kind of have to sacrifice some kills to her at certain times. Do we go invade his red? I mean, if Janna wants to, I'm down. We have nothing to play for bottom for a minute. Caitlyn should be fine by herself. We can go... We can go take red and then go top. My set does, apparently doesn't even need us. We can still look, though. If I was Tom, I would not expect Janna and Timo to be hanging out here. Oh. Oh, sweet fucking Jesus, Mother of Pearl. Okay, now this is getting a little crazy because Keen's going to be on the way. Okay, good luck us. I'm tanking. Okay, this is so farked. I'm dead. We're alive. Kane's mid, thank God. Okay, let's leave. Let's go get Drake. That already is lost in the sauce too much. Kane goes mid, thank God. Janet gets a turret like a beast. That's already sus as hell. Do we care about Drake or do we get Harold? No, it's definitely Drake over Harold, right? But we don't want Kane to get Harold for free. How do we deny Kane off Harold? If we go to Drake, he'll do it. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go Harold. I don't want to give Harold for no reason. There's no point just giving Harold for free. We'll wait for a set to get over here, cause like we can just get Drake after Harold, right? If we go to Drake now, like four Drakes is better than Harold and Grubs. But if we go to Drake now, he gets Harold. We don't want to give him anything for free. Where this way we can get Harold and go get Drake later. It's not like he can go right to Drake. He's going directly to Drake. He's doing exactly that. Should be okay, though. Our team's locked the frick in, I'll tell you that much. I think we go bottom first. We don't just start Drake. We have to go bottom first. Let's hang out for a second. We, we just have to... We have to give our team a second here. We can't just start Drake without our team's backing. Now we can, right? We heralded mid, so that creates a distraction. So they're going to be looking mid since we herald that. We get Drake. And we wait for our bot lane to get Pryo, which they have now. And I down to run over here just to be like a deterrent for Kane. Just trying to see where Kane's at. There's Kane. We're not actually trying to fight there. We're just trying to make sure Kane doesn't kill my team. Because the thing about League of Legends is that we're so far ahead and we're looking good, but you can always lose. You can always throw. The bounty system's absolutely all, like insane. You don't win the game until it's actually over. I'm just going to go clear my camps. There's nothing else to do. 
bot doesn't need me. Armed and ready. Yeah, Double Lift is getting the ADC experience. He's up 12 CS and he's chilling and his whole team had a breakdown already. His mid's 0-2, his Kane's 1-3. Tom's playing pretty well though. But yeah, it's Double Lift on Jinx. So do we really want Double Lift on Jinx to scale with a Sona and carry the game? Like they, if this game hits 40 minutes, they win for fun. Looks like a big fight's happening. On my way. It doesn't really look that good. Okay, Garen's not coming. If Garen was coming, we'd be cooked. I wonder if Tom's gonna come. Again, I'm just like being a deterrent, right? We're really just waiting for Baron and the four Drakes. All these fights, I'm just making sure my team doesn't die rather than playing aggressive. Because we don't need any more kills. Like, we literally don't need more kills this game. We just need to make sure they don't get our bounties. I'm down to go top after my farm. Kane could be up here. Kane could look for the counter. I mean, Sona could be here too. Because Kane's been off the map for a bit. That's fine. We knew this was coming. It's all good. We can have a bonk here to cancel that. Nice. Do we have the sauce or no? Massive. Right place at the right time. Much good. Good jungling. Get my item. We're locked in. We're locked in cocked for sure. We're locked and cocked for sure. Reading the map oh, beautifully. You saw that map read? Beautiful. Garen is still 1v1 me because of the champ's balance. Just kidding, it's not. But with, with Janna's help, I feel a little more safe. It's mommy. That champ needs to go to hell. That's all I'm going to type. I'm just going to keep typing mommy. See what my teammates think about that. Hi, low comms. Locked in. Armed Deb, what you ready. doing, butthead? And we're just looking for the tower, right? Like, killing Garen, who cares? I'm just trying to hit this tower and get 700 gold. Okay. All right, they're not trying. They're tilted. They want to go next. There's no way Sexy Steve just dropped that Sona ult like that. That wasn't that Sexy Steve. Look at that shroom. Oh, I, I put that shroom on his face, Grandma. That shroom was on his noggin. I wish he would have hit it. That would have been cool. It's a vibe check on, on Janna. See how she feels about it. This is how you Janna, by the way. Like, this Janna, in, insane how perfect she played. I'm not even gonna... I don't think I even want to go for this. I'm pretty sure I just want to stay on objective focused. Like, who cares about that fight? I'm just gonna go get a Drake. That fight literally is worthless to me. Like, don't I just get four drakes and win the game? Isn't that cooler? Get control of, of this side of the jungle. That's gotta sting. If Kane comes and just joins us, I'm gonna be a salty spittoon sailor. Yeah, we're locked in. We're just getting four drakes here. Whatever fight that was, no thank you. I just hobbled to the other side of the map. Four Drakes is the win. Who cares about that fight?
I, mean, I have a lot of gold, but I can't really buy an item. It's an awkward amount. I'll just get Void, because I, I like to kill. We need to kill Tom. Tom's only like pressing tab. The only person. Well, we gotta kill Jinx too. But Void step for Tom. I feel like is mandatory. I've been trying to build Shadow Flame and Death Cat more, and they kind of don't feel that cool. Only way to lose this game is if they still Baron. So we don't have to burger flip it, but I kind of want to. Hey, come back. Tom's doing a good job tanking. Damn, they got out. Not even one casualty. Can we do Baron? Good fight from them. They're showing signs of life. Jinx got her kill. We can still do this, though. We do it really fast with Set and Zed. They're showing signs of life. We got to lock in. Lock in. No throw. I like Janna kind of deterring that. Oh, shit. 50 50 time. Uh oh. Good job by Janna. That Q is kind of clutch. Yeah, we should leave. We should probably lickety split up out of there. Uh, Janna just saved the game because you can see that King was about to steal that shit and Janna queued him right in his face. This Janna is 1v9 as hell. This is how you carry on Janna. So many big plays. Okay, so pretty much I just have to flash on double lift and kill him. And if I don't, we lose the game. That's pretty much what we're looking we're looking like. They have two bottom, which is kind of wild. Do I go mid with my team or do I hunt down whatever this is over here? This Janna, I want to kiss her on their lips and marry her. Why is she like typing cute faces while carrying, while having a sense of humor? Dude, if like what? Who cares about double at this game? The Janna's the goat. Well, we could fight this, but we don't have to. Kane's jerking us off in the wall. Yeah, go freaking push that wave, you turd. Okay, we did not die here because this is like if we if we die with Baron and throw it, it's not good. I'm just pretty much playing defense for my team here for my AD carry. That's fine. Nice Sona. Dude, Sexy Steve. Sexy Steve is having a tough game on the Sona, I'll be honest. Sexy Steve is having a really tough game on the Sona. Zed pushes bottom. Set doesn't die top. We sit, we grab the mid wave. Set dies here is really bad. We're kind of cooked if he does. We just play it slow and look for these. If we can get two turrets from it, it's fine. We're going to position upwards here. Um, yeah, that's a turbo throw. We got a GTFO. All right. Jinx has two kills. I mean, Jinx has two kills and, de and 11 CS a minute. And she has a fat ass front line. So we're getting a little worried now. We really, I mean, we're playing this game perfectly too. Like imagine if we were throwing and shit. I'm gonna go run at him. Drake is gonna be Moss Importante here. We're looking Drake. Yes, sir. Do I go there now? I think I go there now. This is all that matters, right? Doesn't matter if I get a couple more camps. We just need Drake. We need Drake. Hextech is one of the best Drakes in the game. Drake or FF? We gotta lock in, y'all. Gotta push mid like a beast. Hell yeah. Really important play. Really important fight. We have ample time to set up. We did good. Damn, I lost vision. I wanted to get a little chunk on him. That's a little wild, I'll be honest. I'm not gonna lie. That is insane. Okay, we got we got Jinx. At what cost? 
Okay, we got two. I got Jinx and we got Keen. That should be enough. A Shroom pops off there. Okay, we did our job. We didn't choke. We got Jinx and we got the Keen. That's massive. My freaking asshole's the size of a penny. Because if we don't kill Jinx there, she kills everybody for fun. And we got Kane, and we got Soul. That's massive. There's no way we lo lose with Soul, right? Like, not a chance. It's not possible. We got to do that all over again on Baron, but this time I don't have Flash. It stinks. Garen got my shutdown. Doesn't really matter, I think. Size of a dime is how this thing goes. Oh, my asshole's the size of a loaf of French bread. Oh, my bad. I think the saying is the size of a dime. A penny is pretty big, huh? Yeah, the Tom is playing great, too. Like, it's Jinx plus Tom. The classic, and also it's double lift, right? He did a good job just farming and be, and becoming this threat. Okay, our set's going full ED. That's a little wild, I'll be honest, but it's fine. We have a lot of time, so I don't want to just sit there at Baron right now hanging out. We're looking for a pick first. That's fine. Just scare him. Just scare him. That's okay. Maybe it makes him think twice before face checking. Taylor's facing. I feel like she should say, I feel like we want to control this area. I don't want to put all my shrooms down because those shrooms are never going to last. I think I wait here, honestly. I don't think we start Baron. I think that's bait. I don't have flash this time, so. And we should be pushing top. I don't know. Dude, Zed should just be pushing top. That would be so clutch. That macro is pretty sussy baka. Okay, that's a pretty fat flank. I got I got blind on Jinx. I got blind on Jinx. Okay, that settle was massive. I mean, we should just get inhibs instead of doing Baron. We should just get the three inhibs. We can get him without Baron. We kill Sona. That's massive. Do I really die to Garen here? If I die to Garen, that's gonna be toxic. They're chasing Jinx. I'm, I'm scared. Massive. Okay. I did not die to this guy. Give our team a second. No ego. All right. That settle was massive. Really good settle. Really good follow up from us. We get all three in hips. We get all three. I don't think we end the game. Maybe we end the game. Oh, freaking. We locked in this game. We locked in. We made pretty pretty smart plays the entire game. And we didn't just farm on the team of jungle, right? We actually played the map, played the game. I'll tell you what though, sexy Steve on the Sona support got gapped by the Shanna pretty hardcore. Big game, big game, we locked in. Big game. Big game. Hey, look at that ads are about to run too in 10 seconds. Gotta give it to Jana. She was, that was Dami Mommy right there. Most damage? Nice. All all the Drakes? Very good. GG's. Let's check out the runes and stats here. So obviously most damage we saw that. The runes. 15 from press the attack, 16 from cutdown. Pretty fat. GG's. Nice.